Kwetiau goreng, Indonesian for fried flat noodle, is a Chinese Indonesian and Malay Singaporean stir fried flat rice noodle dish. This flavorful and spicy fried noodle dish is common in Indonesia. It is made from noodles, locally known as kwetiau, which are stir fried in cooking oil with garlic, onion or shallots, beef, chicken, fried prawn, crab or sliced bakso, meatballs, chili, Chinese cabbage, cabbages, tomatoes, egg, and other vegetables with an ample amount of ketchup manis, sweet soy sauce. In Asia, kwetiau is available in two forms, dried and fresh. Its recipe is quite similar with another Chinese Indonesian favorite, mie goreng with the exception of replacing yellow wheat noodles for flat rice noodles, ubiquitous in Indonesia, sold by many food vendors, from traveling street hawkers in their carts, warungs, to high-end restaurants. It is one of Indonesian people's one-dish favorite meal, although street food hawkers commonly sell it together with mie goreng and nasi goreng fried rice. Kwetiau goreng is also served in Indonesian franchise restaurants such as S. Teller 77, its closest analog probably is char kwe tiao popular in neighboring Malaysia and Singapore. However, it is slightly different, since Indonesian kwetiau goreng usually tastes mildly sweet with a generous addition of sweet soy sauce, spicier with the addition of sambal chili sauce as condiment, and mostly using halal chicken and beef instead of pork and lard to cater to the Muslim majority population. However, some Chinese restaurants in Indonesia that serve non-Muslim customers, might use pork and lard. The most common protein sources for kwetiau goreng however, are beef, chicken, prawns or crab. For the Muslim population in Malaysia, char kwetiau is often called kwetiau goreng. In fact, the term kwetiau goreng in Malaysia refers to the halal version of char kwetiau which prefers the use of beef and chicken and omits pork and lard. Origin Chinese influences is evident in Indonesian food, such as bakmi, mie ayam, pangsit, mie goreng and kwetiau goreng. The dish is derived from Chinese stir-fried shaha fen and believed to have been introduced by Chinese immigrants in Indonesia for centuries. The Chinese first made contact with the Indonesian in the 7th century, and by 1600s Chinese settlements have already sprung up along the coast of Java and Sumatra. With centuries of interactions between the two cultures, resulting the blend of Chinese and local cuisine. Kwetiau goreng is very similar to Chinese Malaysian and Singaporean char kwetiau. However, kwetiau goreng has been more heavily integrated into Indonesian cuisine, for example the application of popular sweet soy sauce that add mild sweetness, stronger flavor, sprinkle of bawang goreng fried shallots, addition of spicy sambal to add spiciness, also might add krupik topping to add crispy texture, and the absence of pork and lard in favor for shrimp, chicken or beef, to cater for the Muslim-majority Indonesians. Variations just like mie goreng, kwetiau goreng recipes might vary according to its ingredients. The popular variants are kwetiau goreng sapi beef, kwetiau goreng ayam chicken, kwetiau goreng seafood seafood including cuttlefish, prawn and fish, and kwetiau goreng kepating crab. The kwetiau goreng pitas hot and spicy, uses a lot of chili pepper, while kwetiau goreng sayuran mainly uses vegetables. Another popular kwetiau recipes is called kwetiau kua kwetiau with soup, kwetiau ayam chicken kwetiau with soup, and kwetiau saram poured kwetiau, that instead of stir-frying, the flat rice noodles are boiled or poured with thick soup or sauce instead. Another variant called kwetiau bun, similar to kwetiau goreng but more moist and soft with the more addition of water, there is a variation called kwetiau goreng lenyer, which is made by slicing the pempek and mixing it with chicken, prawns, eggs, bean sprouts and soy sauce. See also Char kwetiau Beef kwetiau List of noodle dishes References External links Indonesian beef kwetiau goreng recipe